Roken is the leading brand of OST optical see-through technology. Weighing only 76 grams, Roken Max Pro has the same spatial interaction capabilities as the Apple Vision Pro, such as gestures and sounds, and additional multi-screen displays and virtual keyboards and other interactions can adapt to mobile scenarios as well. So with me is Misa Zhu, um, who's the CEO of the company, to tell us about the Roken VR glasses. So I'm very curious to hear about these. What are the key features of the glasses? Pretty much it all, it's all about spatial computing. You know, spatial computing actually can do a lot of things. Uh, for example, you can watch movie and uh, with mode window. Um, and, and of course, you can do uh, gaming, uh, 3D gaming stuff. And uh, yeah, of course, uh, productivity stuff like office uh, something. And so uh, I think it's pretty much it. Uh, same features as the the the, the latest the product like a uh, 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 Apple Vision Pro can do. Yeah. Um, so but, talk about. Know, it's more, uh, yeah, it's more uh, the wearable and uh, affordable, right? Oh, affordable. How much is it? Because I, I know the Apple Vision Pro is is quite expensive. Well, okay. you know the slogan of Rocky. The, the the slogan of Rocky is uh, leave nobody behind. So we just uh, we don't we. We don't want to build like luxury product. Uh, we just want to make, uh, of course, we want to make a wonderful, uh, high quality and uh, high performance product. And uh, but uh, not only about the high performance and high quality, and but also affordable. So it's yeah, going to be the sales price is going to be like a you know hundreds of uh, US dollar. Okay, so, got it. Now, what about the optical see through technology? Why did you decide to to do that? First of all, we just want to make up uh, the people understand that actually we have more options. So not just one single uh, uh, technology direction. Like the evolution, the more options and uh, and the more opportunity to uh, new technology. So uh, the the point is, I, I we don't uh, we don't agree that people have the have to you know, in the future people don't have to live in the immersive digital world you now we just want that people can also see the uh, 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 physical world uh, with the naked, naked eyes so this is a total different uh, product uh, definition total different uh, 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 vision and the mission the, the, the like a goggle style uh, uh, VR or MR products so yeah that's the, that's different between uh, you know, the product and the, and the other company do. Do you have any metrics in terms of, of sales for the glasses? Well, I'm, I'm sorry. Do, do, you yeah, have any, the, uh, do you have any statistics or metrics for the market demand for Roka glasses? Well, okay. Um, uh, no, first of all, uh, XR uh, category actually is very big. So there are many different uh, styles product, uh, uh, products right now in, in the market. But if we're talking about the glass-like, the uh, glass that glasses style uh, uh, AR product, uh, first of all, we, we don't do the VR because VR is all about digital information that make people immersive in the digital world. But uh, we, 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 we do actually it's AR, it's augmented reality. Actually, it's uh, more about mixed the, the, the physical world and the digital information. So, uh, so we are now, uh, if we're talking about the glasses, glasses style product, I think we are the biggest uh, market share holder right now. And uh, uh, something around uh, uh, 30% Interesting. market share. Are there particular industries that you're targeting with the glasses? Well, uh, AI actually can do a lot of stuff, like what I said before. And um, but uh, today, actually, it's it's, it's very popular in like uh, education uh, industry and uh, and uh, some digital culture industry. For example, the museum. You now we got like pretty much one hundred percent market share uh, the museum uh, experience in China, AI experience in China, and we're now working on the global business right now. In, uh, and of course, the heavy industry, uh, like uh, uh, the auto business uh, for the car companies, something for uh, for AR for the manufacturing. So, uh, and of course, to the consumer and the information and the entertainment. So 
you can do everything right now. Not uh, not specific to some like a uh, uh, a very vertical uh, industry. So I think that's uh, that, uh, that's why I said uh, that's why we want to build an AR product to the to the consumers to the market. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, it's amazing the applications that you can do with this. What about the anticipated market share for the glasses in in industry? Well, like what I said, we we we're now uh, talking many uh, uh, vertical uh, industry right now, but most of the the, the heavy industry market, uh, I, I think we got more than fifty percent market share right now, and the the, the, the museum business uh, actually we got uh, one hundred, pretty much one hundred market share in China, so it's very big and very successful, and we just uh, spent like four years to do that. So to 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 make it, so and in the, in the consumer market, I mean the glasses style design, uh, uh market uh, uh, the category actually Rocket got like thirty percent uh market share right now, so not bad. Yeah, oh, and China is a huge market too, so um that's that's amazing. What have have you got data or feedback from the users of the glasses on what they like or you know what have they said about using these? Well, actually, we didn't take any uh, data, you know, back from mm -hmm. the, the the users because the privacy is the most important thing uh, uh, in in rocket uh, product design. So I think uh, we we don't we don't take any data, you know, back from the, the end users. It's so sensitive right now. So you know, I, I think you know about that, yeah. especially uh, you know, the the global. If you want to go do the global business, you you got to leave the data, you know, uh, 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 in the local. Yeah. And then what about the competitive landscape in virtual reality, augmented reality? We talked about Apple, but Facebook has Oculus, and there's some other virtual reality uh, groups in the works. Like, How is the competitive landscape in this business? Well, it's complicated. So you know, if we're talking about XR, we, we call it a mixed reality business. We are, like, we are all now... Uh, Working very hard to 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 make the future happen, you know. To uh, but if you're talking about the glass glasses style business, actually the competition is not that uh, critical. So you know, Apple and the and and the Meta and the Microsoft, they do the product like goggle design and with yeah, yeah. Uh, maybe more powerful but more you know uh, uh, goggle like. And we just want to make a the affordable product and uh, a, a daily use product. So we just want to make it more comfortable and it's pretty easy to use. So I think it's a different uh, category. So we don't have uh, a, a very tough competition with the Apple and the, and the Meta right now, maybe in the future, but right now actually we're, we're now in a different category. Yeah. Oh, that's interesting because I know some like the Oculus goggles, people think they're kind of bulky and heavy, um, but it sounds like your product is lighter and, you know, easier for the consumer to use. Yeah. So it's yeah. a different uh, design, uh, design language and, and, mm. and, and different vision mission, like what I said before. Yeah. So uh, more options to the, to the end user. I think it's a good thing, right? Because people have more choice. Yeah. Are there any partnerships or collaborations that you're doing with any other companies? Oh yeah, a lot of uh, a mm -hmm. lot of them. Uh, we got like more than two thousand uh, developers and oh, partners okay. right now. Mm -hmm. Okay, and most of them are enterprise, and some of them are uh, you know uh, just a uh, personal a uh, uh, personal developer. Um, for example, uh, maybe, maybe you heard about that. The biggest uh, telecom operator in Japan. Uh, that NTT Docomo actually is uh, is our, our partner in Japan, and then we are we're, we're uh, uh, keeping talking with other uh, telecom operator uh, in, in the global right now, with some uh, other countries. So uh, Rocket are uh, uh, what what Rocket are working on is build an open ecosystem to everybody and globally. Mm -hmm. We just want a global ecosystem. What's the resolution? Of the rocket glasses. Um, well, it's uh, it's complicated uh, complicated as well because in in AR business or, or, or uh, to XR product, the resolution is, is not the most important thing. Actually, it's the PPD is the most most important thing, pixels per degree. Okay. 
So more, uh, the bigger PPD you got, the more detailed image you got. So for example, the, the human being, uh, 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 the human being, the, 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 the max the PPD you can tell uh, is actually about like 30 PPD. Uh, uh, sorry, uh, 60, 60 uh, PPD. Okay. Uh, uh, let me tell you, the Apple Vision Pro PPD is it, 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 it's something around like uh, 34 uh, PPD. Uh, and uh, uh, the Meta, actually, the Meta Quest uh, uh, 1, 2, or 3 actually lower than the, than the Vision Pro, uh, as, as you know right now. And guess what uh, the uh, what PPD uh, of, of Rocket products, actually, we are now the 40. Oh, 40, 40. okay. So we are not. So oh. uh, we, we, I think the whole industry uh, are working harder to match the max the PPD uh, that people need. But today, we still got many jobs to do. But Rocket is, uh, I think, is the... The, the, the best PPD product right now. Yeah, interesting. Well, I understand you're coming to the U.S. I can't wait to meet you and to see the glasses in person. Oh, sure. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, looking forward. Looking I think forward. you're going to love it. Yeah. Yeah. As soon as you put it on, you're going to understand what I'm talking about right now. Yeah. Okay. I'm looking forward to it. Thank you so much, Miso, and uh, we'll see you soon.